She doesn't know yet. She does not know yet. I've been wanting to move for some time now. Ready for more space. My problem right now is I'm dealing with procrastination. Now, here's the thing. I have about a month, actually a little more than a month. I have till the end of October. That's more than a month to get this move done, which sounds great. Having a nice slow roll on moving, that sounds great because I remember times when I moved, it's like one day, but now I have like a whole month. So that means I'm gonna procrastinate. There's, there's no, no way around it. I'm gonna procrastinate. So having kitchen stuff and moving is the hardest thing because pans, for example, pans are so heavy. Cookbooks, why is it that cookbooks are the heaviest of books? Like one cookbook, look. This is just one cookbook and look how thick that is. This is, this is, that's a heavy book. Even the cookbooks are the heaviest of the books. Like all of the cooking related stuff, that is the heaviest shit to move. You know guys, I've been working on a lot of projects lately. I've got the cookbook going and then now possibly a show. And then I have these events going and then multiple relationships I'm keeping up with. And then I don't even, I'm missing a lot of things. I know there's more things going and it's just tough to keep up with all this stuff. And moving is something that I've been looking forward to for a while now to have more space. That sounds amazing. Do you guys ever feel like you could use just like a fresh, clean start somewhere else, like just moving to a new spot, even if it's in the same town? That's how I feel right now. Having like that clean start. Like I'm probably gonna throw away a lot of stuff, maybe give away a lot of stuff. All this stuff could be a lot to go through. And it's good to just get outside, go for a walk. If you guys are ever feeling overwhelmed, just get outside. Whenever I go out and I go for a walk, my mind just feels so much more clear. Like what was once like all jumbled up and messy, now it's just clear, super chill. Now I feel great. I mean, you can't go wrong with a freaking view like this. This is amazing. This park is beautiful, especially during sunset. Just look at this. Man, some of these benches are depressing. It's a what? That is so sad. Our current right now is sweet potato sausage or purple yam sausage. Oh, I'll try that out. Sure, I'll do some of that. Just a small cup. <laughs> no need for a sample. Oh, sure. Thanks. Sure. All right. Really addictive. I'll do that. That sounds great. Wow. That's Bob. Thank you. Look at this crazy thing. That's fucking delicious. So it's a purple sweet potato, and they said it has ube and a sweet potato bean, bean paste. And it has little mochi balls. Mm. I've been really into launching my car right now. I'm not gonna show you guys the speed because I don't wanna get a ticket, but here we go. my gosh this thing is fast you remember earlier when i was talking about being overwhelmed tonight was one of those nights something happened i'm not going to talk about it because you know frankly i don't want to talk about it but it wasn't good and uh yeah just going for a night drive and that's definitely helping my grandma she used to she used to put me in the back seat go drive around the block like four or five times and then I would fall asleep. That's how she would usually get me to fall asleep. She was always worried. She was like, you know, I, I'm gonna be worried that you're gonna be driving one day and you're gonna fall asleep because you're so used to falling asleep when driving. That was a funny one. I really miss talking to her. Okay, vlog, if you guys don't know, I love Quest chips and Quest sends me lots of chips. I have chips here, I have a box of chips there, and they just sent me this box. Okay, I can't pretend. I know what it is. I opened the box. 
already. And these things are fucking delicious. Check this out. Okay, so I don't know who this chick is. She seems pretty cool. Anyways, check this out. I was skeptical. No longer skeptical. These are fucking delicious. They're like, they're like the peanut M&Ms. They're so good. Today, I'm gonna be taking this out. I've been loving this camera lately. This is the Fujifilm X100V, and it has these film simulations, so you could take all kinds of like filmic type of photos, just like this. It's pretty sick. Gas today is 5.63. Let's see where that gets us. Can't wait to take some photos with this. The lighting is perfect today. Usually when lighting is gloomy, that's the best time to take photos. It makes anything look cool. See, even that looks cool. I'm gonna miss this park. I love walking this park, man. Like every day I walk to this park. Hopefully there's a good park where I'm moving to because it's kind of nice being able to get out and walk in circles in this beautiful park with all the ducks and the water and the greenery. Gotta miss it. She doesn't know yet. She does not know yet. She's not gonna like it, aren't you?